What is going on YouTube and welcome back to another Madden 21 Ultimate Team video and y'all already know week 7 team of the week has just officially been dropped on Madden 21 and I uh, also got a next gen news update for you guys I'm going to be talking about that right after uh, this but before we get started man y'all already know smash that like button subscribe if you are new turn on the noti bell and join the noti gang go follow the instagram and twitter we are 18 subs away from 200 and y'all know what that means that means a 300k every single monday right before the new content anyways guys let's get into it we're gonna start with the next gen news update man and uh madden 21 will be live on xbox series x and playstation 5 on december 4th of obviously 2020 so also you guys know what that means if you did buy madden 21 already it goes on to the next console you do not have to buy it again that goes for both playstation and xbox so well let's get into the team of the week man that is the next gen news update uh, December 4th basically is the main one. We already knew about the uh, dual entitlement, which is it transfers over to the next system. So we're going to get into the team of the week. So here we go. We got a bunch of new team of the weeks. We got the main one. We got Tyler Lockett. I said to you guys it was going to be Kyler Murray and Tyler Lock or Tyler Lockett, more Tyler Lockett, which I was correct. But one thing I was very, very wrong about was the heroes, man. I got Herbert right. But I said it's going to be mainly offense. I was very wrong about that. We're going to go look. And uh, it was really a lot of defense, too, if I'm being completely honest. I mean, I think they just have to do defense for the hero or the defensive team of the week hero, like the uh, throwback one. There's always going to be a defensive player. I had a feeling the guy in the Chiefs would get one. I didn't say it in the video, but I, once he got the pick six, I said out loud. I was like, oh, he's definitely getting a team of the week. But I forgot to talk about it in the video. But I did think he was going to go on Devin White and... Um, uh, I can't read, man. I literally cannot see on here, man. Anyways, whoever it is, um, I did not mention them. I did not even know how good they played. It was Jerry. It's Jerry Hughes, by the way. Jerry Hughes. I don't know. I just can't read. My screen's so tiny. But yeah, I did not know they were gonna get one. But uh, yeah, so we got Tyler Lock. We got Will Shields, right guard. I did not think we'd get an old lineman, but we guess we got one. And uh, Rodney Harrison, strong safety, and then a bunch of 80s to uh, 82s or uh 80s 88s so um we're gonna be talking about all these cards we're gonna start with what you need for the tyler lockett you need the justin herbert you need the jerry hughes you need two of the Devonte adams Devonte adams also got an upgrade by the way and you need devin white two devin whites actually so you need two devin whites two Devonte adams one jerry hughes and one justin herbert for the will shields you need two justin herberts three Devonte adams and three of the uh, i don't really know how to pronounce his name it's the harrison oh wow never mind I thought it was someone else harrison bryant tight end for the browns um that is the third one you do need so you need three of him three of harrison bryant's three Devonta adams two justin herbert's for the will shoes it's actually not that hard other than the justin herbert if i'm being completely honest rodney harrison you need two jerry hughes you need three devin whites and you need three of the um this is the guy i actually don't know how to pronounce his name and he's not even on auction so one i can't see the names that's the problem here i might be able to pronounce them i just cannot see the names and it's really annoying me here it is daniel sort all right now it's easy daniel sorensen so that is how you pronounce the name i don't know why i can't like my screen's just so tiny and the letterings look so tiny because i'm on the thing i don't want to switch to the other input that's why i always say i cannot see the names i've been saying i cannot see the names on this channel for a really long time now so uh yeah don't judge me on that i just literally cannot see so anyways there that's what you need for the sets of course the exchange set 78s to 82s um usually i put a coin method on these but they just get worse and worse every week so i'm not going to tell you guys to go and do these um actually maybe this week could be a week where you could harrison bryant they're, they're 80 overalls and they go for about 10k all right you know what maybe you might see a coin making method video in a little bit don't know for sure all right but those are the sets we're obviously going to go into what they have in the store and get that solo done we're gonna be talking about that in a little bit too but here we go in the store as per usual they have the team of the week packs they have team of the week pack week seven they got the bundle of nine team of the weeks and the topper i don't know what the topper is we're gonna look at the topper an 80 to 88 overall team of the week player from week seven uh team of the week packs not worth it in my opinion i maybe it is for you guys but i don't know ever since i pulled ltd amari cooper and the kevin moai 
my pack luck has been absolutely terrible. And if you guys have been on the, on the channel lately, I haven't popped any sort of packs. So, uh, yeah, that's why. All right, so solo challenge. Here we go, man. Team of the week solo challenge. Always get these done weekly if you have been doing them. Just keep doing them, man. Stick on it. Even if you're, like, a little bit of tired of Madden or something, I don't know. Stick with it, man. Where's the team of the week? Oh, here it is. So team of the week, week seven. Um, play a full game. Score three passing touchdowns. Light work. And uh, nope, you don't get anything this week. But now we're going to go look at the stats of the Tyler Lockett. Oh, I almost forgot. Limited time Joey Bosa as well in packs right now. Limited time 92 overall Joey Bosa. Cards a beast. He's got a 94 finesse move. So we're going to go look at these uh, these cards in the uh, auction block. If they're not an auction block, I'll just read it off my phone, obviously, like what we usually do. But they should be in store by now, or in auction, I should say, by now. I want to say, but we'll have to find out. So let's go look. We're going to look up the 92 Joey Bosa first. Hopefully he is here. He should be. He is. So there's one Joey Bosa on auction right now. 92 overall left end Joey Bosa. 80 speed, 88 excel, 87 strength, and 86 tackle. 93 play rec, 78 blocks, and 89 power move, and a 94 finesse move. This card's a beast. Um, I really do like this Joey Bosa card, not going to lie. So now we're going to go look at the Harrison, the Rodney Harrison, the Tyler Lockett, and the Will Shields. So let's go see what they're doing up in there. We just got to find them quick. Where are they at? They're got to be far down only because they just dropped. So Lance Briggs, we're going to come in. Damn, they're, they're pretty far down here, man. No lie. Here's the Will Shields. We're going to start with Will Shields since we found him first. Right guard Will Shields for the Chiefs. And uh, it has nothing to do with me. So 89 strength, 90 awareness, 88 pass block, and 87 pass block power, and 89 pass block finesse, and 91 run block, 89 run block power, and 91 run block finesse. So he's got a pretty good run block, a pretty good pass block. He's good strength. This card's pretty solid, if I'm being honest. A really good card right here in Will Shields. Go pick him up at right guard. You guys do, do need a right guard. Wait for his price to drop, though, or wait till Series 3, guys. Series 3 update. I'll be posting a video on that once it is announced, guys. Um, basically, all I'm really going to say is sell your teams when Series 3 comes out. That's going to be a big thing when Series 3 comes out because uh, you're going to want to sell your team, man. Y'all know the auction, or the everything drops in price drastically once everything comes out. Wow, Tyler Lockett's up for 3 mil. That, I don't know. This guy thinks anyone's going to buy him for 3 mil. He's crazy. We got a 92 speed on him. That's the main reason. The 92 catching, another great reason. 83 jump, 86 catch in traffic, and 90 spec catch, 89 short, 87 mid, and an 89 deep route run. Um, Card's really good. I mean, he's got that catching of a 92 and the speed of a 92. So that right there just makes the card great. That's really solid. And now we're going to go look at last but not least. That's Rodney Harrison. If he's on auction, he should be by now. All the other cards are. So here he is. Rodney Harrison. This is going to be the last part of the video. He's got an 89 speed and 90 XL, 90 tackling, and 90 play rec, 90 pursuit, 75 man, but an 89 zone coverage and a 90 hit power. This car can do everything. I wish he was a little bit quicker, but other than that, this card's a beast. So that is it for the video, guys. If you guys did enjoy this video, smash that like button. Subscribe if you are new. Turn the Naughty Bell. Join the Naughty Gang. Go follow the Instagram and Twitter. And like I said, man, 18 away from 200 subs, and that means 100K every single Monday for you guys. If you guys do subscribe and hit 200 with me. But that's pretty much it, guys. Peace.